Good morning, lads. I just arrived in a hotel here in Ibadan. I came with my brother. Guys, I'm gonna give you guys a quick tour of this entire hotel. So this is the bedroom, television here as well, and toilet. Yeah, we have the sink and mirror. Nigeria is located in Western Africa, completely surrounded by Niger, Cameroon, and other Western African countries. It's a massive country with a size similar to Bakas, making it the world's 32nd largest country. The full name of Nigeria was gotten from River Niger, which means a large country in West Africa. To get around, you need a bike, car, public bus, and keke. My natural impression of Abuja is that roads are well paved, but I always see pedestrians walking on the street. In Nigeria, there are so many churches and mosques across the roads. So we have made it to the site of tire production. This place is a place where tire are being you know, sold, imported tires, and also produce tires in the eastern part of Nigeria. This is a good producer. Hey, big man, how far? How far now? Yeah, I agree. Yeah. You do okay? Uh, what I do, tire business for you. Yeah. How the business is good? Nah, the business is good now, but you know, it goes on dollar issue now. Dollar issue. Uh, so, business now, you don't understand. Yeah, yeah. So, these tires that you guys sold, is it imported or like made, yeah, made tires? It's, it's imported now, it's imported. Yeah. yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, you know, tire, we, we don't do tire in Nigeria here. Oh, okay. yeah, so, it's better we to import it. But it's from which country? Like From China, Thailand, yeah. it depends. Oh, but mostly China. Oh, okay. yeah. So, what's your name? My name is Ebuka. Ebuka. Yeah. Okay, I'm Amy. Yeah, Amy. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, business in Nigeria is kind of good. I'm glad that people here are happy. This is the uh, like soundboard. Face. Maxi Nigeria. Welcome to Motor Tire and Team International Market. These are the entire shops around this tire market. What kind of brands? Do we, we have here? Yeah. We have many brands. Okay. Yeah, we have like we have Michelin here. Okay. We have Austin. Austin. Okay. Yeah, we have Rodex. Rodex. Okay. Yeah, like, like like this one. This. This, this, one, one. this one is is Rodex. Rodex. Oh, this nice. one is Torado. 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 Yeah. This one is Maxis. 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 This one is Godard. So we have many brands. And around this yeah, place. Yeah. Only I deal with many assorted cars, car tires, yeah. truck. We also have KK. Who was the biggest? Uh, market of tires in this place. We have Transano. Okay. We have Joy Road. Okay. We have Hoteli. It's oh. a nice product in the market as of now. Oh, it's nice. Raining. Oh, yeah. okay. This, 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 this way build. Okay, these uh, are way build. Build. Yeah. Wow, So you send them to different states in Nigeria. Oh, wow. This is our garage. Is this like church? Yeah, yeah. yeah it's how it's, 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 it's we use this is like seven feet tall. <laughs> this is kind of taller than me or close yeah. to my height. These are where you can find warehouses. So, I just met a local Nigerian spot leader. Yes. So yeah. how is the work going? The work is fine. The work is fine. Yes, and everything good. How long have you been doing the job? I've started dispatch work since June 30, 2020. Yes, that, that was when I made my first delivery in my life that as a dispatch rider on my own under the name Dispatch Express Logistics Service. Oh, nice. So what was it like to be a dispatch driver? Uh, it's very okay. It's fun. Being a dispatch rider yeah. is part of education. You will learn a lot. Do you think being a dispatch rider in Nigeria is very, very lucrative? Actually, it's lucrative. I get me. Yeah. But because of the condition, because of the economic situation of the country now, yeah, it's, it's a bit hard. A bit so hard. People are struggling. You know, you know, for now, yeah, price is very high now. Because of the fuel is high now, yeah. people don't have enough money to pay. Oh. So it's making it's affecting our business. I guess uh, a lot of a lot of logistic company yeah. have been folding up because of this economy crisis. So do you think the situation in Nigeria will improve as time goes on? It can never improve if there is no any changes. 
Oh, wow. Government have to do a lot in attaining our economy. Yeah. Government have to do a lot so that people can live peacefully and business can keep growing. Let me tell you the fact. This you no know, way attached mm. to a lot of things. As as a dispatch rider, as a dispatch company, yeah. What you based on one major things, one major things we need most is for. Oh. Without where we are powerless, that we are, we don't we can't do anything. Well, so far, it's expensive. It's in expensive Nigeria. now. I wish you the best of luck mm. in your business in Nigeria. Thank and you I very much. Things get better for you. Thank you very much. I look much. like a serious, you know, rider. I could see <laughs> you are well dressed. I'm happy to have you here. Yeah. I have a song to sing. Okay, 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 give us a bit. <laughs> I am rider in my country. country. Everybody know me where. Yeah. If you look me up and down, you, you will know that it's true. These are churches here in Nigeria. So this is where people come and worship. That place as well is where there are box, like public bus that take people around. Yeah, look at that. Around here, there are different buildings. Let's say five buildings or churches. Oh, nice. America. One thing I know for sure since I've been traveling is that God is powerful. God is everywhere. You find different places where people worship. People always acknowledge that there is God. So this is um Nigerian gala. It's made with beef. It's doughy on the outside. Tastes a bit um, chewy, so Ojota Park, and uh, you know people here are happy and nice.